as I said, each of us were asked uh, to submit a number of, of images. Uh, you'll see displayed in the booth uh, for the Center of the Legacy of Photography. Uh, these uh, are uh, oops, three uh, images, which is an Alvin Langdon Coburn work, a portrait of Alfred Stieglitz made uh, approximately 1905-1907. He considered it one of his uh, great achievements. He gave the print that uh, you see here. This print uh, is also in Stieglitz's own collection, which is at the, the Met. So it, uh, in his day, uh, he felt it was an example of his own masterwork and featured it as such, and it has ever since been uh, valued as such. In uh, looking at our collection, we have the Alvin Langdon Coburn State. Uh, there are a number of versions of it, including the original negative, which is a key to the explanation of the round format of the picture. And I just present it uh, as a historical example of a work that has, for well over 100 years, been recognized as a master work uh, by the photographer, by the uh, people who know photographs, by collectors, by dealers, etc. Uh, had I known Coburn in his day, and he showed me this picture of being a wise guy from the Bronx. I'd say, where'd you get the idea from? The Indian on the buffalo nickel? Like, uh, nobody would ever say anything like that today. And yet the, 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 the origin, you know, the, the whole context of where would this image come from, uh, the matter of the fact that it is a solution to the problem that the nation <coughs> itself was distressed and the only way he could get a uh, full image of the head was to print and trim uh, in a circular format. Uh, it has a long tradition in the arts, uh, so it relates to the history of art. Uh, there's a lot to say about it from an art historical point of view, which helps to make it a masterpiece as well. One of the questions that I have <coughs> in my mind, is if I was asked the question, what's more important? Your knowledge of the history of art, your knowledge of the technology of photography, or your knowledge of photographic history. All three of those things overlap, but they're not the same thing. Uh, from which category is the major uh, uh, imprimatur coming that this is a masterpiece, this is a work of art, not a great work of photography. It transcends photography. And that we'll hear more.